Good morning, boys and girls from First Baptist Church. This is Miss Frankie coming to you with the children's sermon for today. I want you to look at the things I brought here on the table, some of my favorite things, and I bet you can tell where Mr. Don and I have been this week. Here's a starfish. And here's a sand dollar, a big one. And some shells. Beautiful shells. Do you think you know where we've been this week? I'll bet you do. Yes, we've been to the beach. We went down for a few days of vacation this week. We didn't get all these shells this time when we went to the beach, but we have gotten them in the years past and saved them. Did you know that Jesus taught his disciples that it was important for them to take a vacation? Jesus' disciples traveled from town to town telling others about God and his love for them. They traveled every day preaching, and teaching and healing the sick. They worked so hard that they often didn't even have time to eat or to sleep and they became very, very tired. In the Bible, Mark 6 verses 30 through 32 tells us about Jesus talking to his disciples. It says, the disciples gathered around Jesus and reported to him all they had done and talked. Then, because so many people were coming and going that they did not even have a chance to eat, Jesus said to them, Come with me by yourselves to a quiet place and get some rest. So they went away by themselves in a boat to a solitary place. Now, a solitary place means a place where there's no one else around. If you're in solitude, it means you're all by yourself. So Jesus wanted the disciples to go with him to a quiet place where there were no people around because he knew that they needed rest. I think it's important to notice a couple of things about what the Bible says here in these verses. First, Jesus said, come with me. When we take a vacation, we need to remember to take Jesus with us. Some people never give Jesus a thought when they go on vacation. We should include Jesus in all that we do, even when we go on vacation. And secondly, the Bible says the disciples went away to a quiet place. Their main purpose was to rest and renew their strength. Some people plan a vacation that's so full of activities that when they come home, they're more tired than they were when they left to go on vacation. I hope that you have a great summer vacation. Don't forget to take Jesus with you wherever you go and set aside some time for rest and to relax. Then you'll come back home refreshed and renewed. Let us pray. Dear Lord, Thank you for vacation time when we can rest and renew our strength. Help us to remember to include you in everything we do. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Remember, boys and girls, to stay safe. And remember, I love you and God loves you too.